All right, so Helium put out a, a blog post today, and I just wanted to share some of the information from it. They, they gave an update on the mining, the status of all of the miners that people have ordered, and what their, their plans are for the future. So I'm just going to share a little bit of that information. So as of today, April 9th, 2021, we're at 26,000 hotspots. They have a uh, Discord with 28,000 people. The validator test net is underway, so staking is coming for Helium, so you'll be able to stake your coins if you have over 10,000 coins. There'll also be services that other people uh, provide where you combine your coins together as a group to stake. I would be very careful in who I choose to stake my coins with because you, you want it to be a big, you know, a big platform, a trusted platform. So they'll charge a fee, obviously, but that will be an option. Helium Mappers, the website is mappers.helium.com. They updated it and it just shows a 3D top, topographical map of the Helium network. They have a newsletter and then, yeah. So we'll just start with the first point. So in March, Bobcat, which is the newest miner, uh, they shipped 2,000 miners to China. And they started the network in China, right? So you can see on the left side is before and then after. So that pushed the network past 25,000 hotspots. There's 150,000 third party hotspots on order. So if you think about the 25,000 that are currently available on the network, there's going to be 150,000 on the network, right? When they, when they all get delivered. And I'm sure every day there's thousands being ordered, right? They're not stopping the orders. Then they're just saying staking is coming. Uh, they're thanking all the validators on the test net. So that'll be coming and they just want to make sure it's right before they get to staking. So what you'll do is you'll lock your coins up and then you'll be able to secure the network as a validator if you have 10,000 coins. And in, in turn, they make the validators or they pay the validators interest. So the interest starts really high when there's a low amount of validators and then it goes down. So I'm guessing that Helium will be paying five five to 10% annual on their final staking product because that's what Ethereum is paying. And I think everyone in the Helium community is going to stick with Helium. They're not gonna sell their coins as much and they're gonna to wanna to stay in for the long run as long as it works for them, right? So the Mappers site has been overhauled. They have a new integration partner. So Tag.io, they're gonna be having tons of integration partners, but Tag.io is just a cloud platform and they provide dashboards for analytics. So if you have data that you are using the Helium network with, you could possibly use Tag.io as your service provider to just visualize that data. Uh, one big thing is Southern Connecticut State University, they're the first to join, and they'll be deploying hotspots and IoT solutions. So the students, um, I don't know if the students are mining there, but they're going to notice Helium miners all over their campus, and then maybe they track the students' uh, I don't know, the, the students' cars or the students' persons. I don't know what they're going to use to track the, the IoT solutions. But yeah, you'll be able to use Helium on that university. Now, that's big news because other universities could want to do the same thing. Then they have some other partnerships that they, they mentioned, Next Machina and Streamer. And then as of content, um, they have some content provided for people if they want to do the test net helium hacks that's a really good show every once in a while they have some great people on helium hacks so i mean diabetes monitoring on the helium network i saw something for seniors where they could use the helium network for life alert for example because you need to have wi-fi so if, if someone fell and they weren't they were they lived alone they could somehow like tap the button and then that would be sent over the helium network so there's a lot of great things uh, in store with helium so i just wanted to bring that that um update with you and so we're at where we're at with the miners we're still at eight weeks plus you know six to eight weeks plus but i i think it's more like 15 weeks it's there's a supply chain issue there's a there's a technology shortage in general when it comes to the manufacturing industry and helium just got caught in that so that's all we have for today if you have any questions just uh shoot me a message or comment below if you really found this valuable please hit the like button subscribe to my channel and also i have a helium mining business plan that just outlines 
if you already have a minor, this is more for you if you already have a minor or you have one on the way, how to maximize your helium earnings, where to place your antennas. So if you're interested in that report, um, it'll be, you can just actually shoot me a message and I'll send it to you. I'll send you a link to the report. So just comment below and I'll send you the report. So that's all we got for now. Thank you very much.